Hey, hello and welcome to this week's episode. Contrary to what you might think, this is not a prison cell. It's my new green screen technology. Absolutely, this isn't a cold place out in London somewhere. Anyway, I've got Marissa Fagan with me today, uh, all the way over from the States. That's how popular I'm getting, so call me, I might be able to fit you in too. Anyway, one thing that really annoys me is finding out which conference to go to throughout the year. There are like a gazillion security conferences out there at the moment. Half of them don't even sound like security conferences. When you've got conferences like BrewCon or DerbyCon or ShmooCon. You should have seen my boss's face the first time I said that. That was a security conference that I want to go to. But I believe that there is a solution to all the problems. I do. It's a new website that we've started called setcore.info. Mm -hmm. It's a website that the way that will help you is it's got a great conference calendar. So all of the conferences, all 256 of them for the year, are all in one place. I didn't realise there were so many conferences held throughout the year. But what makes that any different from any of, like, I don't know, I suppose me trawling through and collating my own list or another website? Is yeah. there any other benefits you offer? There definitely is. There's a whole lot more to it. Um, we've also got the CFP calendar, so you can see what CFP deadlines are happening uh, during the year and not miss anything in the future. Cool, yeah. I, I've often fell for that trap myself that I, I've said that I'm going to submit a CFP and uh, you just miss the deadline and, and you don't even know when, when it happened either. Exactly, that's why we started the website. I know it happened to me too. You see a CFP being talked about on Twitter like six days after it was due and you're like, oh, I wish that I had had a website that would send me an alert two days beforehand. Mm -hmm. and that's exactly what setcore.info will do. Excellent, excellent. Now, I heard that there's one more feature that is your particular favorite on this website. And it's not the fonts, is it? It's not the pretty colors or the little flower in the corner. No, it's not the flower in the corner. What it is, is you can rate everything. You can rate speakers at conferences. You can rate the conferences themselves. And so after we get a whole bunch of people to sign up, we're going to be able to see who has the best speech for the year and what's the best conference, just based on the rating system. That, that sounds brilliant. I mean, because the, I sometimes look at a, a conference and I say, oh, Vladimir Boritsi, or he's talking there, and I have no idea who he is. Love or, Vladimir. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> uh, but now I do, because he's got five stars. He's consistently getting good reviews, all of them from Russia for some reason. But anyway, um, it's a really good resource. I think it could become a, a, a very useful tool if it catches on. We're hoping that it will. Yeah. I mean, we've we just been at, uh, there's a bar behind us where all the B-Sides crew have been for their, their bite size, and um, there have been a few lightning talks. So how would you rate, say, like Matt's talk uh, that was there today? I'm thinking a three. A three? I think that's being a bit generous, but <laughs> OK. We, we've got, how would you rate the overall B-Sides uh, bite size event? Good question. I think B-Sides bite size was definitely a five. A five, yeah. Five. <laughs> And uh, her, I think, she was definitely a 5'2". I'm pretty sure that's the waitress. I don't care. She's, she's still a 5. Yep. Stay secure, my friends. <laughs>